this demonstration shows applying a patch strategy to bring 1,000 subclouds back in sync. In the cloud overview, we can see that the subclouds are out of sync. Under Software Management, we go to the Cloud Strategy Orchestration tab. Click Create Strategy to open the dialog box. The strategy we are creating is a patch strategy applied to subclouds in parallel to a maximum of 500 subclouds at a time. The Software Management tab is where patches and strategies can be built, configured, managed, and applied. Patch strategies may also be aborted or deleted here. The system controller is stage one, the first group of 500 subclouds group two, and the second group of 500 is stage three. We can sort subclouds in various ways. We will now apply the strategy Remember, the window must be refreshed to show the current status of the subclouds. The system controller has updated and the patch strategy has moved on to stage two. After refreshing, we see that the state for stage two has moved on to creating strategy. Some subclouds have the patch strategy being applied and updating patches. This demonstration is applying a simple no reboot patch and should progress quickly. More complex patches would require more steps when building the strategy, possibly migrating VMs and or host locks, and would save thousands of steps when being applied to thousands of subclouds. The patch strategies are in process on an increasing number of subclouds. Again, we must refresh the page to see the current status of our subclouds. Subcloud patching is starting to show as finishing or complete. We can filter for subclouds by name or the state of subclouds. Cloud Strategy Orchestration has many under-the-hood features to simplify and speed up the patch strategy's implementation. We have effectively made changes on thousands of subclouds with a click of one button. We now see that all the subclouds have updated, implementing the patch strategy. Next, we delete the implemented strategy. We will now return to the cloud overview. As the system audits itself, some sync statuses change to in sync after a refresh. All the subclouds have been audited and now show their status as in sync.